Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to Plain Truth. Yui Long uh, has a, uh, they were talking about Yui Long, apparently share the wealth. Now, Yui Long was quite a character. He liked to uh, come across as he was kind of a, a small-time backward, uh, uh, almost like a hillbilly in a good sense, uh, young man, uh, very simple and all that other kind of stuff. But he was, he was brilliant. He was brilliant. He went to law school uh, three years down over there in Louisiana after he got all his other degrees. Went to law school. Uh, Three-year course, he got it done in eight months. And when he went to the Supreme Court to pre played a case before the Supreme Court, the Supreme Court Justice said he's the most brilliant lawyer that's ever appeared over there. So uh, he, had a, he had a great intelligence, very smart. But one thing that uh, he wanted to do, he said, well, wait a second, why should all the wealth be in the hand of these super-duper uh, millionaires in those days? And uh, uh, people are starving. Uh, why should we be plowing uh, wheat under the, uh, into the ground, potatoes into the ground? Well, people are starving in the cities. They could use those different things. Uh, he, ca he came up with all kinds of great, uh, logical, sensible things about what's going wrong with America. And good old Huey Long uh, was going around and became very, very well known. And he was threatening to become the President of the United States as far as the the, the big shots on Wall Street were concerned. Well, eventually, Yui Lung was killed. And uh, unfortunately, uh, for America, all these other things that he was predicting should not be happening took place. So, uh, good old Yui Lung uh, was assassinated. And we have to be careful with what happens to some of these people that are speaking up. They should be protected better. And uh, uh, he, sh he sure was wiped out and his ideas kind of set back because that nobody else could pick up the, the, the thing. And he was only about 40 years old when he died. So he had a great career ahead of himself. And uh, uh, he wanted to socialize certain things over in Louisiana. Uh, he made the corporation start paying for the schools. Uh, and he wanted a school near every uh, white family or to, so the white kids could walk to the schools down there. Uh, Unfortunately, uh, the black people didn't, couldn't vote at that time, so he, he wasn't that concerned about that, unfortunately. But uh, he did, well, did speak up for helping out the people. He started putting in highways down there when there was only 312 miles of highway in all of Louisiana before then. Uh, what happened was he put in a, a 3,000, and he did not raise the tax on people who couldn't pay. He raised it on these different corporations. They didn't like it, but they gave part of the wealth to helping out. And that's what he was, as I, Louis Long, Huey Long's uh, great idea was, spread the wealth around a little bit, not just in the hands of the super-duper rich people in those, in those days. And should, some of these ideas should be going around today, too. Thank you very much for watching Plain Truth.